Hey guys, this is Comic Uno, and today I'm doing a review for Powerpuff Girls issue 3. Uh, so I did get this digitally. This is probably the only digital comic I wasn't able to get on my iPad. Um, I read it through my laptop. Uh, but yeah, we'll still talk about it. The cover is the thumbnail for this video, so if you want to check that out, you can. Um, and the art's pretty much like the cartoon, so uh, it's pretty much the same art. Uh, but before I start talking about that, of course I have comic Una episode 24, and that's the show where I review all the comics I read this week in one show. And there are a lot of exclusive comics, because I got a lot of comics this week. Um, also, I have another thing coming up called... I guess, the poll for comic Una episode 25, and you guys can vote for what issue I should review for comic Una episode 25 that I usually don't review, um, and that should be up, I would say, Saturday, so I'll annotate that on this video on Saturday. Uh, but here are the exclusive comics, Sidekick issue 4, um, that's a digital comic, Morning Glories issue 35, digital comic, Wolverine X-Men issue 38, we got Nova issue 100, or really issue 10, it's like an anniversary issue. Uh, Hawkeye, issue 14. Avengers Assemble, issue 21. Teen Titans, issue 25. Red Lanterns, issue 25. Green Team, issue 6. And The Flash, issue 25. So if you want to check out all those reviews, go to Comic Uno, episode 25, uh, 24. And uh, let's talk about the Powerpuff Girls. Um... This is IDW comic is issue three. I don't know if it's a mini series. I'm pretty sure it is. And uh, I've been enjoying the series. You know, I, I wouldn't say it's the best like um, adaptation to a TV show to a comic book because um, it's not. But I really like um, that it has the same tone as the TV show. And I think with this issue especially, I felt like I was watching an episode of the show from early 2000s uh, and you know 90s. I really like that feel, and I, I, you know, even the beginning is like the city of Townsville, and uh, you do have that feel. The narration, uh, the narrator actually saying that, and uh, the plot of this story is that all the ex villains, ex villains, uh, like the Green Gang. Um, I can't think of everyone's names. Princess Girl. Uh, it's been a little while since I've seen the show, but. Uh, yeah, so all these people that are, used to be villains are helping out the town, and there's no no one to punch in uh, Buttercup's uh, language and her quote from the from the book. Uh, but what is going on? We find out that he is behind, you know, he, the villain, uh, is behind whatever's going on. We don't know why he's doing this, what's part of his plan, but the Powerpuff Girls, they're all for it. They're like, oh, cool, everyone deserves a second chance. Mojo Jojo deserves a second chance. Why not these people? Uh, so I'm really excited to see what his plan actually is. Um, so I feel like with this issue especially, it felt less of a one-shot story and more of like, oh, that's a cool cliffhanger. Let me read more. And again, I really love the tone of this issue. I felt it was like a Powerpuff Girls uh, issue, uh, especially the dialogue between uh, the sisters, obviously Buttercup, Blossom, and Bubbles, I felt was very smooth dialogue. Uh, and I just had fun with this one. I think this is the best issue so far of the series. Um, just bringing back a lot of nostalgic uh, villains and, uh, you know, really curious sub... Um, I would say a very curious... I don't know if it's a subplot or the main plot. Um, I would say this is the main plot. I feel like the Mojo Jojo uh, plot may be more of the subplot. Uh, but yeah, really enjoyable. Uh, the art is great because it's just like the TV show. And uh, I think if you want to read something nostalgic, if you like the Powerpuff Girls, uh, I think you'll especially love this issue. And I really enjoyed this issue. Uh, so I'm going to give this four stars. It was very solid. Probably the best issue that came out so far. Are, and I'll, I'll, of course, still be reviewing Powerpuff Girls. Uh, so we got, I hope you guys enjoyed. This is Comic Uno. And guys, don't forget to follow me on Twitter for Comic Uno and their own situations. And don't forget to like me on Facebook. See you guys later.